This is another story of rhinoplasty in Iran, this time about Esmeralda, a girl from Spain who comes to Iran for doing a nose surgery with Dr. Hamid Reza Hosnani. Esmeralda is a close friend with Amal, who was featured in the previous video and is a very beautiful and happy girl now. Uh, I have a close friend, her name is Amal, and she explained to me uh, about Dr. Hosnani and her trip to Iran. During the consultation visit, Dr. Osnani inquires Esmeralda about her expectations and demands. I would like it to be natural, um, but at the same time, to be really beautiful. Then shows her a lot of photos similar to her case who had already done surgery with him. She agrees with the doctor that she wants a mild curve without too much elevation of the tip and a natural looking result. While examining the inside of her nose, Dr. Osnani noticed the deviated septum. Esmeralda said that she had broken her nose when she was a child. For better understanding of the condition, the doctor advised her to prepare CT scan photos of her nose. Computer tomography scan or CT scan makes detailed pictures of internal structures of the nose. During the test, she lies face down on a table that is attached to a CT scanner, which is a large donut-shaped machine. Blood test is carried out to make sure that she is in a proper health condition. Professional photos from different sides of her face are taken to be mounted on a wall in the operating room. On the day of surgery, Esmeralda fills up a few forms, writing down a summary of what she has already agreed with the doctor. After that, she puts on surgical gown and then gets ready for operation. Everybody smiles at the clinic and makes her completely comfortable and happy. <laughs> Before the surgery begins, she meets the doctor again, confirms everything with him and then gets ready for anesthesia. Everything okay? Everything okay. Oxygen mask, okay? Anesthetic medicines are injected and then an oxygen mask is being put on her mouth. This is nose of Esmeralda right after surgery. The slight curve and natural look as she expected is totally achieved. A plastic cast called splint is being put on the nose and a dressing under the nose. Esmeralda is waking up from the anesthesia. Blurry. So it's kind of like, oh, looking, trying to recognize stuff. Can I have some water, please? I asked for water immediately. I felt water in my lips, and that was, I you know, like amazing. Oh, like water because I felt really dry. Hello, Doctor Osnani is here. Doctor Osnani. I'm here, Doctor Osnani. How are you? <laughs> Your surgery was uh, very excellent, successful and very excellent. She's Esmeralda, just back from recovery and with all the jelly mask to prevent bruising. Yeah, no pain, lots of happiness, just very sleepy. <laughs> okay. How was the first night at the clinic? Oh, it was so amazing. I felt like loved. Really? <laughs> stuff. Not just like they were taking care of me. They were like, I feel like they were like my mom or my auntie. The morning after surgery, the nurse drops her pomades, puts her droppers and teaches her how to use the medicines. She leaves the clinic to rest for one week and then she comes to the doctor's office for the removal of nasal splint and the sutures. She cannot believe that her nose is actually looking like the model nose she showed to the doctor as a dream nose and that the actual result turned out to be much better than the computer imaging. My patient, but the result of surgery is better than the computer imaging. Mm -hmm. I look like her! <laughs> and I felt so much love from everyone. I not just welcome, not just that they cared, but I felt loved. I felt like, wow, these people do care about me. It was an amazing experience, an amazing trip as a whole, so I'm coming back.